key thing with the obedience is that he has to know when to do it and when he's done. Right? Okay. So if you say to him, Carl, sit, and then you give him this, now he's already up. I see what you're saying. So okay. you want to give him a free command. Right? So what I would do, I'd say, Carl, Carl, good boy, sit. Good, sit. Free! And then give him the cookie. Right? So that before he hears that, he stays whatever it was the last thing you said. Right? Okay. Right? Okay. So try that with him. Carl. Sit. No, you just did the same thing. Free. Don't give him the oh. cookie until free. Oh, don't yeah. give him the cookie until so free. So we use luring when we want to teach him the movement. Once he knows the movement, then we want to expect him to hold it. And don't do things that telegraph what's about to happen. For example, yes. Carl, right? He's like, oh, he's getting a cookie. So later when you don't do that movement, he's like, well, you're not doing this. I'm not going to get a cookie. So it's Carl, Carl, hey, Carl, sit, good. Free! And then I reach in and get a cookie. So now he has uh, no indication. So the cookie's not in my hand when he's doing it. I can There's no precursor to my obedience. And that's how people, dogs become uh, cookie treats. Or the, the, the dog won't do it if I don't have a cookie. Well, he doesn't know I have a cookie. I don't have anything. Hey, Carl. Uh, Carl, sit. No, sit. Good. And now I'm not going to give him the cookie. Good boy, free. Carl, sit. Now he did. Yeah, free. Right? And then he gets the cookie. Okay. Right? So that's really important. You gotta get the little pieces because that's where the and, dog trick. Incremental a, too. Yeah, a smart dog like him, he's gonna figure out he's not doing this, he's not doing this, right? So there's nothing, it's just one word. The word doesn't mean anything. You gotta build meaning around it. And it's really not even a word to him, it's just a sound, right? It's a sound, yeah. It, that becomes a word. It okay. It becomes a command. So try it, just get his attention. Carl. Carl. So, th so if you have to say it twice, give him a little tap it or step on the leash, tap it. Okay. Carl, come. No, don't touch it. There uh, you go, Carl, good. Now. Sit. Good. Sit. You can tell him, good sit. Good, good sit. Right, don't release him, just good sit. Now free him. Carl, free. Right. Yes, good free. Good. Be aware he might not need this anymore. It doesn't seem like he does. Okay. I mean, try, you can keep yeah, he, doing it. That he's getting okay with, it's yeah. heal and stay. We'll get that. His, we'll get that. His nemesis. We'll get it. All right, okay. so let's do one more sit. Carl. Sit. Good sit. Good. Free. Excellent. Good. Good Okay, so free. now let's put in the stay with the st sit, right? So the way I'm going to do that to him, first of all, I'm going to put this since you're using a prong, I'm gonna put it on the on the dead ring, right? Now okay. you don't so when you put it on the dead ring it means you use both rings, oh, right? Okay. <laughs> it's, it's less bitey on them, right? It's yes. a little less impactful. But what I'm gonna so do here both rings. Yeah, so okay. and this is just for this. I'm gonna say sit, stay, and I'm gonna put pressure. Good stay, stay, pressure, good stay, right? Pressure, stay. Now I'm only repeating it each time because I wanted to know. Stay. Now watch. Good stay. I come back. Free. I throw it behind him because his natural tendency is to go for the treat. And if I walk away from him and I go, yeah, and I give him the treat, it's exactly what he's going to do. Uh -huh. I don't want him ever coming to me unless I tell him to clearly. Okay. Right? So try that. So the movement is here. I'm, yeah. I'm going to put the cookie away, right? Training your dog should not be complicated. In fact, it should be fun for both you and your dog. I designed a program that does exactly that. Whether you're looking for puppy training or beginner obedience, advanced obedience, problem solving, leash pulling, aggression, anything, anything you can possibly imagine. I have more than 170 lessons, over 60 hours of instruction, all available at one low monthly price. I guarantee you're gonna love it. In fact, if you don't, I've got a money-back guarantee. Check it out now at robertcabral.com. Carl, hey, good boy. Sit, right, and I'm gonna say stay, and I'm gonna put pressure. So this is already like, why is he doing that? But he knows, stay, 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 stay. Now he's at a big distance, good. Now the worst thing you'll do now is you'll free him and you'll give him a cookie from your pocket. I'm gonna say stay, 
Now I'm going to go free, and then I'm going to reach in my pocket, and then I'm going to throw the cookie behind him. Right? It's a okay. big piece, <laughs> but he'll get it. He kind of knows it already. Right. Now I you just got to learn. Yeah, you got to learn. It. <laughs> I yeah. got to get it. Right? Okay, so go ahead. Okay, Carl. Stay. Yeah. Carl. Sit. Stay. Right? Stay. 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 Good. Go back to him. Don't, Stay. Good. Don't push him. Come, come forward. Forward. Release. Free. Free. There you go. Perfect. Okay. Good. So, all right, let's call him back. Carl. Carl. Good. Sit. Very good. A little pressure. Stay. Stay. Good. Stay. Good. Stay. Now just walk in place for a second. Say stay. Stay. Walk in place. He's got it. He understands the picture now. That's exactly what you want. Walk back to him. A big excited free and then toss a cookie. Free! Woo! Good. The important part of this is that he's never getting rewarded this way. Got it. Right? Because that's the picture that's going to make him go, oh, I'm just going to go, I'm going to get ahead of myself and go see dad. Go dad see loves me. Go see where he's going. Right? Okay. Yeah. So don't add too much distance too fast. Okay. That's critical. Three feet-ish. Yeah. Yard. I mean, for, for the next week, I would do three to five feet. Okay. Right? And what I would start doing with him to make it a little bit more challenging without pushing him too far is I'd say, Carl, sit. Good. Sit. Stay. And I go here, ah, 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 ah. and right there, that's what I want you to learn, is that when he makes that mistake, Immediate. right away you start making some weird noise. Hey, 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 what are you doing? He's going to go, oh, what, what happened? He's going to mark that moment. If you wait, it's not going to work. Good boy. Carl, sit. But it's not a big no. I'm not punishing him. I'm not hurting him. It's like, hey, 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 what, what, dude, what's going on? Right? Stay. And I go to this point. This is his distance, right? Mm -hmm. Now, what I want you to in, in place is walk in place, stay. And I'm going to go side to side. Stay. That good. If he starts to move, you stop, right? If you see him flinching, good. This is a big piece for him. Stay. And now I'm not even looking. So that now I don't have that frontal pressure, and he could easy. But I'm watching him. Good. Stay. Come back. Praise him. Good boy. Good. Stay. Free. And then toss the cookie. 